Good morning, evening, or afternoon, wherever you are. Look at that crow over there. It's windy. We're about to get into a storm. This is like the calm before the storm, if you were. But yeah, it's gonna get windy and really rainy for the next couple days, so I'm gonna be hunkered down. And It's gonna be interesting. Like I said, I got some wood, so whenever it stops raining, I'll be able to make a fire real quick and try to warm everything up and dry all my stuff out, because it's gonna get moist. It's just, I hate using that word. Anyway, today's video. Hi, welcome to my channel. I just have no production value. My production value is I brushed my teeth. Namaste, baby. I know some people have some really cool. There's some really beautiful artists that I'm, I'm subscribed to. I don't know her name. Either. She's very Russian. Beautiful artist. Um, and she has such really beautiful production value on her videos. I mean, yeah, it's really cool. I don't have that. <laughs> I don't have that kind of, I don't know, it's just not my thing, but I'm just really, you know, shoot, about, shoot at the hip, right? So, you know. Anyway, this video is about <clears throat> energy. It's about, oh, it's about stalking energy. It's um, obsessive energy. It's about taking a break from things that are draining you. Um, for example, I've just had to try to transmute a war. But, you know, in transmuting that, found out a whole bunch of other stuff's going on too, like bioweapon labs and all this amazingly horrible shit. I did a video before that I, I deleted. That was the one that was just, I don't know what happened. But in that video, I made a plea to Elon Musk. Is that his freaking name? Whatever. Build a starship. Period. Build a starship. I don't know if the Starlink crap. We don't need satellites. We got a fucking million of them up there just doing shit. Bouncing into each other, right? And China apparently has a satellite killer where it attaches out the satellites, just destroys it. Yeah, it's trippy. Anyway, go figure, Chinese. Sneaky bastards. But they make amazing food. Oh my god. Anyway, and I love the people. Just the government sucks. China, I would love to go to China. Oh my god. I would love to go to Wuhan and all that. But unfortunately, there, there's some really beautiful provinces. It's just, yikes. Anyway, <sighs> what was I going to say? Oh yeah, yeah. Sorry, see, it's my channel. I'm going to do what I want. I'm going to ramble. But it is about energy. It's about, see, like my energy is drained and I feel drained. And it's important for you to focus your energy on yourself. Self-love, self-worth. Don't give, don't expect it from somebody else. Don't, uh, that was my problem is, you know, growing up, I had abandonment issues and, and trust issues. Like I didn't even know. Here I am an empath, and a really powerful empath, and I didn't understand what's going on, so I'm just miserable all the time because I'm constantly being just, just, you know what I mean? It's like, fuck. You know, the total opposite of what you want in life is what you get, what I got. I mean, it wasn't orphan, little orphan Annie, or, but she got rich in the end, right? It wasn't like Oliver Twist, I, you know, I was I was fed, and I had at points, and I had a roof over my head, and but it was, it was, yeah, it was a, every day was a fucking struggle. It wasn't, there was no calm waters. And I had rich family around that could have helped, but they were so self-absorbed in their fucking toxic behavior. It just, I didn't matter. I was a blip, right? So I had to learn to love myself and to, and to heal all these traumas and I'm still working on them, right? But it's something you need to work on is your own self. Because I would always try to find, I mean, I've dated a lot of women and, I've try, and I and you try to find that nurturing, you know, to heal, you're trying to find somebody to help you heal the traumas, heal the, you know, and sometimes it does work that way when you actually find somebody who's on the same path and they're vibrating the same and you meet each other and you both heal each other in your love, which is always a wonderful thing. But for the most part, it doesn't work that way. You have to heal yourself. And plus those people, when they find each other, they're already on the path to healing. They're not just like some broken down, you know, in a crack house, you know, usually they're on their way to healing themselves and then you know so it's almost like the universe rewards them with a partner to help them in their struggles whatever <clears throat> but you got to get on that path first and to get on that path is to focus on yourself and not on others regardless you can't I mean 
I just need to focus on me at the moment. Take the next three days off. I'm not going to do any videos. I'm glad I can still do videos, but I'm not going to do any videos. I'm just going to chill out and do me. And I'm just going to burn some wood and eat some food and play with some cards and just enjoy the moment and rest. Get a lot of sleep. I, I didn't want to get up this morning. I was so tired. I mean, I was tired. I don't normally. I usually get up early. But I just wanted to sleep in. And that just tells me that I'm drained and I need to recharge a little harder. So I'm going to take a break, not talk to anybody, not see anybody. It's going to be amazing. And I want you to do the same. I mean, everybody's got it differently. I don't, I'm very blessed to be able to be in my own world and I can just hide and, you know, I literally made money two days ago. I made a hundred bucks selling my art and I didn't, I wasn't even selling. It was just some guy knocked on my van and I was like, shit, that was a cop, right? He's like, oh, are you selling that? I'm like, hell yeah. So yeah, that was cool. That helped out a lot. Gave me some gas and some food and. Yeah, and I mean, bought some firewood because I knew I was going to need it. I knew it was going to be three days of pouring rain. So it's kind of like when I first got here. That was fun. <clears throat> so it's going to be really windy. It'll be exciting. So remember, focus on you. You love yourself. Don't worry about anybody else. Don't obsess over anybody else's shit. Don't watch ex-boyfriend's videos or ex-girlfriend's videos. Don't obsess over anybody. Here's the thing. And I crush on, like, I have some, a couple readers I'm really crushing on. But I don't focus on them. I don't sit there and keep, oh, I'm constantly watching their shit. I love when I get advice from them and, I, and their voice is soothing and I really appreciate that. But at the same time, I don't focus on them because I understand how that can be draining for their energy. Especially if you're, you know, powerful enough. So I have to focus on me. I have to wish them well. I know there's one that I've, I haven't talked to, I mean, haven't heard from in a long time. Chime Time, she was one of my favorites. She's just like a, you know, a comforting, like, friend. You know, it's it's not really it's soft crushes. It's not nothing really super hot or sexy, but I'm sure it could be. They're they're all goddesses, but at the same time, it's just it's respectful kind of crush. Anyway, and that's how you gotta look at it. Don't crush on anybody. Crush on yourself. Okay, love yourself, and that's the end of it. And then you know the right guy and girl come along. But you know you can't force the issue. You can't. You know it's just the way it is. Like my. Like I said, I'm, I've been celibate for almost 10 years, whatever. It's been, and it's going to be a minute before I get back into anything. I'm not going to jump into this. Yeah, come on now. You know what I mean? At this point, you you either shoot, you know, you're. Sh I was swinging for the fence. I want the home run. I want the happily ever after. And that's what I'm going for. And I won't settle for anything less. And it's a tough one, kid. I'm telling you. Everybody's going to have it differently. Everybody's going to vibe differently with different people. And, you know, it's a. To find somebody you actually even can tolerate is one thing, but to find somebody you can tolerate and they make you hot and you can't wait to, to tear their clothes off, that's that's pretty awesome too, right? So you kind of want all that. You want the bond, the, the loyalty, and the, the shirt ripping off, you know, hotness. But anyway, I'm going to let you go. Focus on yourself. Love yourself. Have a wonderful weekend. I'm going to hunker down and enjoy my rain and wind, and we'll see what happens. I'll see you on the other side, babe. Okay, bye. Oh, I love you, God loves you, and the universe is still digging you. And loves that new hairstyle, if you got one, because that'd be weird if you thought I knew. But anyway, <laughs> love you, bye.